All right, hi, I'm Michael. I'm Nash. And we are back with a brand new game. Now, this game was invented by Nashi yesterday. So the game is called Fishing for Tens, and it's based on Go Fish. Now, uh, we've got a regular deck of cards. We've taken out the Kings and the Jacks and the Jokers. Aces are ones, Queens are zero. So Nash, shuffled it up. What do we do to start the game off? We each have seven cards. So we deal seven cards to each player. Three. And what's the and then in the middle we're gonna make like our big pond to go fishing. Alright, now Nash, what's the aim of the game? What are you trying to do with your cards? Make as many tens. Now you can make a ten using two cards. Or three cards. Okay, and you can do that using any operation at all? Yeah. Okay, all right. So, so do you want to explain what did you just do there, Nash? Seven plus three. So seven plus three is ten. Beautiful. Is there any other way you can make a ten? Oh, I've got one, Nash. Oh, yeah, sorry. Six plus three plus one. Okay, beautiful. There you go. And I've got eight plus... Open brackets, eight divided by four, close brackets. Yeah. So eight divided by four is? Two. Eight plus two, bang, that's a 10. All right, do you want to go first now? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I show you what I got more. All right. Things. Okay, so I'm going to ask Nash. Nash, have you got a five? Go fish. Okay. Have you got a zero? Oh, I do have a zero, Nash. Yeah. Take that. Do you have a zero? Uh, yeah, I do have a zero. <laughs> yeah. Okay, now if Nash gets down to zero, you draw three more cards. Yeah. Okay, so you have one. Uh, go fish. Are your cards. Okay, so I'm going to guess that Nash has got an eight, because you keep asking for a two. Nash, do you have an eight? Yes. Okay. And then I'm going to say, do you have a nine, Nash? Yes. And do you have a 10? Yes. 10 times one? Is 10. Yeah, he's 10. So now I get three new cards and I get to keep asking that I Ash. Yeah. Okay. Now you have a five. Go fish. Do you have a three, Nash? Go fish, or seven. Not anymore, I know. <laughs> All right, so this is the last part of the game. Do you have a ten? Go fish. Okay, so now we get, I reckon we get, do you want to make three questions each and then we finish? Yeah. All right, do you have a five? Two times five is ten. All right, do you have a one? Go fish. Okay, your turn. That's a nine. Do you have a three? Go fish. So I'm I'm out. I've only got yeah. I've only got the nine. Okay. All right. So we're done. Yeah. Cards that we couldn't use get put to the side, and then we're just going to count up how many different times we were able to make ten. Five. Alright, I'll count up or do you want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen? So that means I am the winner today. Alright, that game's called Fishing for Tens. Easy to play, all you need is a deck of cards, and obviously you could change the target number if you yes. wanted to. So you don't have to do fishing for ten. That's the second time we played it. Yes. Or third. Or third. We hope you enjoy it. Good on you, Nash. It's a great game. Mm -hmm. See you next time. Do you want to play again? Mm, maybe. Actually, yes. Actually, yes.